Dan the man so today what we're gonna be doing we're doing another review so if you don't know where this is this is my room if you're saying so yeah today is gonna to be a review now for my birthday which was last month um I went to new basketball shoes so that's what I did and I bought them but I did something new this year this year what I did was I bought my own custom shoes which means you can like customize your own one to make shoes so I gave them my own colour, my own colourway, uh, my own kind of style. Um, so basically, you can't, these are probably the only one in the world, unless someone else has copied me and they thought that's nice. Um, I recommend you don't copy me because it's my colourway and yeah. But I kind of loved it in some way. So this is the box. It says Nike by you. So that's nice. Um, it came came a couple of days early, it says when the well get delayed like really really early and then came later than I thought it would so like I said it was coming the 14th of January, it didn't come until the 29th but then I said oh it's going to be delayed until the 1st of February which wasn't ideal and then it came on the 29th um, so that was good so here they are these are the Glasgow Rocks, where that's why I've called them Glasgow Rocks, Nike Zoom Rise 2 colorway. I think they're very nice. Look at these, these are just absolutely nice. It's got red there, I know it seems very, very obvious, but you can see the University Red, Cobalt Blue, Blue and Orange Heel, and White um, Ankle, White uh, Midsole, Red uh, Shank, I think it's called, um, blue, Cobalt Blue Lining. Black heel or black insole, sorry, and red tongue. So yeah, I think they're they're really really nice. Um, so just, and you can see the tech is quite faded on both sides. That's the front of it. And that's the back. And it, I put it here just because I tried putting DC, but the D looks like an O. It looks like that basically with like, the line through it. So it's like OC, but yeah. Yeah, the heel. Still has that very, very new shoe smell. Um, it's size is it eight, I think. Yes. So this is the box. This is the other box we slide out. This is Nike by Daniel, which is pretty cool. Super. Oh, dropped it. Um, yeah, really, really nice. Yeah, I've had quite a few shoes actually. A few different basketball shoes. These are my third pair. Yeah, third pair. My first pair were, um, I think it was like a couple of years ago, I think. They were Kyrie, um, Nike Kyrie 5 Cookies and Cream White and Black. They're called Oreos, but they're called Cookies and Cream as well. They were alright, I actually really, really liked them. Um, got them in New York for about $140, I think. I think I'm not really too sure. In the Nike store, like I just said. Um, but then here they're like much cheaper, you can get them for like 70 80 quid, which is, I don't know if that's maybe just what $140 is, but I find them for quite cheap, so, well, I saw them online for cheap, after I bought them, I didn't buy them, but, so yeah, these are probably my favourite shoe that I have, um, then I got, um, Nike Zoom Freak, um, Zoom Rise, no, no, is it Nike Zoom Freak, um, Noble Red, um, which is a player's custom shoe, or well not custom shoe, like shoe brand. And he plays for the Milwaukee Bucks called Giannis Antetokounmpo. It's Greek, very, very good player. Hasn't been too good this season though. Um, probably going to be doing a lot of basketball content, so stay tuned for that. Um, so I moved on to They were really nice. I can actually go, go get them. I think we're over here. Yep. Both of them, so. so these were the Kyrie Fives I was talking about. They're quite dirty on me because I, I used to wear them as casual shoes after um, basketball. Anyway, there we go. Um, so that's the back, Illuminati on it. Yeah, these were very, very nice. If I had the opportunity to get a pair of these again, I would. Um, they did me very, very well, very, very comfy. Um, the difference between the shoes I have now and those shoes are quite big. Yeah, these look like, I don't know, like a 12, and this looks like a 3 to, like, it's huge. 
But after kind of basketball finish for the year, I just wore them out casually. So if we're going out for like a meal, I just like try and look quite presentable with these. I don't know why, I just thought they were very, very nice with things. So if I had like, I don't know, a white t-shirt or a black t-shirt, I just kind of colour code it together. And these are the Zoom Freaks. They aren't quite as dirty on the back on the bottom of them, but they're still yeah, but this is this is worn away. You can tell how that's worn away. It's supposed to look like kind of rough and rigid there. But that's all worn away because I've worn it too much. It just shows that I've worn it a lot though. But then the heel, this bit's it's all cracked. Oh put it shouldn't pop like that. Um the odd kind of orange laces. Number 34 back because that's what Yanis wears. So take my back this kind of gradient along the midsole. There you can see the orange kind of heel. Um crack, I didn't actually realise that. These are these are cracked right there. I didn't even realise that. What is it that? Oh it's all like because there's something in it. Like sand and stuff, that's, I didn't even realise that, I did not even realise that. But yeah, these cost me about 70 from Pro Direct Hoops. Um, yeah, as you can see, I'm quite a Nike kind of basketball kind of guy. Um, but yeah, I really like, because I think Nike do bring out some good basketball shoes. I'm not really a football kind of content creator, but I think they do very good football shoes, as well, football boots as well. So I've always been Nike for pretty much most of the sports I play. I've got a golf um, hat, a Nike golf hat. Um, I had Nike clubs when I was about nine or ten. Um, I've had I've got Nike shoes right now. Um, blue and pink, which I probably, I might review them. I might not. I don't know. Oh, we'll, we'll see. And um, yeah, well, so a Nike kind of jumper thing. It's not really like a jumper. It's kind of like a thing with a hood. Um, and then a Nike. Nike, I've got loads of Nike socks and stuff like that, loads of just odd, not odd, but like things you wouldn't necessarily like, oh well, they don't really matter, stuff like pants and socks, I've got Nike them and stuff. So yeah, so, this is from this to this to this. Which one do you think, guys, is the best? Let me know in the comment section down below. I think it's these. These look the most durable. I know like it's weird to smell them, but honestly that new shoe smell is just so satisfying. I think the colour code is really really nice. No no I've only worn them I've worn them once to try them on see if they fit and they do. I wore them once to do a well twice, but I've worn them another time to do a like a camp thing in my kitchen. Cause I was peeing it down with rain. Um down so I just wore them inside. And like because my kitchen isn't the biggest uh, it's not it's not big, it's not small. There's not wasn't enough room to move about in these, so I just took them off. And that's about it. I'm planning going out during the February week for them to go and play basketball with fellow YouTuber we out here 9542 and maybe my friend Luke. So I'll try them out at some point. Um yeah, so you can see that this is Air Zoom, I think that's what I'm trying to say. I don't know, because it looks like it says Air Zoom. It's like A that way and then R that way. Um This is very, very like Soft kind of material. The detail on this is very, very nice as well. Tiny little dots right there. See that? Yeah. But I'd probably give them a good an eight from an from an eight to nine and a half out of ten. That's just my opinion, though. Maybe because I'm I'm the owner of the shoes. Let me know your thoughts down below. I just watched the shoes going. Um, but yeah, it's got a Nike logo there, just white. As I said, it's gradient. So it's from blue all the way to orange. I think that fits really, really nicely on the, on the red. Um, and then, yeah, the heels very nice as well. You can get different colours. If you go and put in, if you're interested in doing something like this, do Nike's um, Buy You Custom Basketball Shoes. And I'll give you loads of different shoes. Gives you Zoom Rice 3s, um, I think they're called. Yeah, Zoom Rise 3s, Carry 7s, Zoom Rise 2s, LeBron 18s, KD 12s, and Paul George Galaxies, I think they're called. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that's what I think. There's quite a few. Um, 
I went with these because these probably look like the, the style that I kind of wear, some sort of not too high, not too low. These are probably, I get these are quite high. Um, but yeah. And then these are like a mid, and then these are low. So I, I've, I've just had a good, good variety of them. But yeah, that the Kairi 5 next to the, the Zoom Rester looks huge. And then, see, these are about, these are a 7.5 in the UK, which means an 8.5 in the US. I don't know why you, 42 in Europe. Um, and then, this is 8 in the UK, so it's like half a size bigger than this. So, yeah. Thanks guys for watching. See you in the next video.